In the last two videos, we've shared some advice on how to make your art portfolio stand out so you can get into the most competitive art programs too. Here are three more ways that have been so effective for Ashcan art students. One way you can stand out is to make observational work including figure drawing for your art portfolio. This is because it demonstrates to art school admissions counselors a level of mastery of fundamental art skills. A good figure drawing will illustrate the three-dimensional qualities of the model you're depicting, including texture and a wide range of highlights and shadows. It should always include the model's hands and feet and facial expression. You can visually explore all the elements of the model by taking the time to really appreciate the details. There's almost always a local figure drawing class that you can and should sign up for. If not, ask friends and family members to pose for you for up to 40 to 50 minutes. People enjoy having their portraits drawn, so don't be afraid to ask. Ideally, you can do both. Another way to make your art portfolio stand out is to include sculptural work. At Ashcan, students are required to make at least one sculpture for their art portfolio, ideally several using different materials. This is because it's important to show admissions that you can use a range of mediums and techniques. Including sculptural work in your art portfolio shows an ability to think creatively and a willingness to experiment and try new things, which is important for admissions counselors to see in a potential candidate for their school. There are so many different ways to make sculptures and including one or more in your portfolio is a great way to capture the attention of admission advisors. Sculptural work can be representational or conceptual, but the materials you can use and the amount of space they occupy are limitless. Because of the limitless nature of sculpture, with it you can really show admissions that you're able to go beyond technical art and design skills and that you can make art that's different from what other people are creating. Adding a background to your drawings and paintings can also make you stand out. The background is the part of the painting or drawing representing what lies behind the objects or subjects in the foreground, and many students make the choice to leave the background blank, not realizing that it's equally as important as the main subject. The reasons why you should include a background is that a background creates the context, the tone, and the mood. It can also add intrigue and will deepen the narrative. It's difficult to choose a background, but if you want to stand out to admissions counselors, don't avoid doing this. It's easiest to decide on the background before you begin on the final, including color studies. Keep in mind that there is no right or wrong way to choose a background. They can be extremely detailed or very simple. There's only the goal, which is to use the space to enhance the story or the look you'd like to express. Art portfolio preparation classes year round. Contact us at infomanhattan at ashcanart.com and see the classes we offer at www.ashcanart.com. You can see us on Instagram at ashcanart and please subscribe below for more art portfolio tips.